Okay, so we're up to um, the second to last row. Um, this was the start of it. And we increased here, we increased here, and we increased here. Then we started our shaping, which was from here. And you can tell by these little ridges here, with, get, which gives it some texture, because this is uh, in the back loop and the in both loops. So it kind of gives us a texture of the yarn. Um, so what I did a little bit different on the last row, and I'm getting ready to come up to the last row here, is I, uh, so this one is behind both. This one is back loop. And both of them. And then what I'll do is I'm gonna go up to the first stitch of that chain stitch I did at the beginning and pull that through that's that slip stitch now the last stitch instead of go instead of just going uh, back loop in both loops back loop in both loops I decided that I was going to do um, one that was just all in the back loop to give it this this uh, this rim here, this uh, brim of the hat. I thought it looked a little sharper. And all you have to do is again, chain two, and all of them double crochets will be in the back loop only. And that's what will give this uh, an edging that looks a little tighter. Just a cute, cute little hat for the little baby. Sharp little baby boy or girl. And then you do this to the very end, back over um, at the very end, which will be here. When you come back around, you'll end up here. And then you'll just cut it off, you'll snip it off, and then you'll weave in your ends. And that's really easy, and we'll show you how to do that on the next video.